I'm Joshua Smith, and this is your chance to get to know me. Um, I started playing basketball in sixth grade. Uh, baseball is my first uh, true love. I mean, I never was good enough to make the major team, so I was on Triple A. And once I um, figured I wasn't um, going to be able to be that good, I started playing basketball in sixth grade and fell in love with it. One thing I like about Georgetown basketball is just the cohesiveness that I have with my teammates. Um, it's one of those things where I, when I first got here, uh, I knew I knew very few of the guys. And, you know, being here and being part of the team, you know, at first it was difficult just because, you know, I had to learn, you know, how Georgetown did things, you know, basketball-wise and school-wise, but now, you know, I love my team. The most memorable game so far would either be the Florida game in the Bahamas or the Butler game. I would say more so the Florida game in the Bahamas because, you know, that's when I remember LJ and Paul hit those shots, you know, the tie the game and give us a lead, you know, before DeVar take the game when they shot and I showed me a lot about the freshmen. I mean, the coaches, I mean, they're, they're basically, you know, father figures for a lot of us, you know, just because we're with them, you know, throughout the year. And, you know, like I said, we're, we're together most of the time, you know, more so than, you know, classes and being with friends and family. And, you know, those are the relationships that, you know, you're going to remember 10, 15 years down the road, you know, the conversations you have with coaches, you know. Some of my interests outside of basketball are really simple. I mean, um, I'm a big football fan, so I'm rooting for the Patriots any sense I get, you know, watching them. Uh, playing video games with my teammates, you know, that's something that we always do, you know, talks back to each other, if it's 2K or whatever, you know, it's kind of, you know, a little bonding. Um, some of my favorite movies, I love scary movies. Um, any chance, um, you know, there's a new scary movie, I want to go see it, but I'd probably say my favorite scary movie would have to be either The Strangers or maybe The First Paranormal Activity. My dreams are life to, to be successful in whatever I'm doing. Um, obviously, I want to pursue basketball as far and as long as I can, but everybody knows you can't play basketball forever. And one thing that I have thought about is coaching. Whenever um, I'm done with you know my career path, schooling and stuff like that, I would love to be a high school coach. One thing that I like about Georgetown is just kind of how it's like a close, um, close-knit, small campus. I've actually, you know, um, been able to value here. It's just how much smaller the classes are and how more hands-on you are with your professors and you know, your professors know your name, you know, they know a lot more about you. My favorite class at Georgetown, it would probably be a tie. Um, I took this uh, sports personalities of the 20th century class with Skip Lane. And then um, I just recently took the sociology of hip hop, the Jay-Z class with Professor Dyson. Something that's um, really important to me outside of basketball is staying up with the social issues in our country and you know, just trying to pay attention. Recently, we were, you know, wore the I Can't Breathe shirts for the Kansas game. And my family's everything for me. Um, you know, my mom, my dad, you know, those are my two, uh, those are my two role models. Um, you know, just coming from, you know, different backgrounds, you know, not always having everything when they were younger and making decisions on their own to, you know, change their life for their kids' kids. And, you know, they've always been my biggest role models. They've been the people, you know, that I love the most. Another one I'll probably just say is this relationship I have with my brothers. Um, you know, I'm a middle child, so I have an older brother and I have a little brother. And if I could say a message to the fans, I want to tell them thank you for all the support that we've gotten this year. The electricity in the gym and the atmosphere and them going, you know, crazy for us. And, I mean, we feed off that, you know. Thank you, Hoy fans, for giving the chance to know me.